Hey, how's it going? My name is Max. In software development, there are often opportunities to extract components from your code into their own modules so that you can reuse them in another project or share them on GitHub. And it often makes sense to then create a separate repository for them. What I really didn't like about my workflow was having to go to GitHub or Bitbucket and clicking around in their web interfaces to create new repositories. I thought it would be much less tedious if I was able to create remote repositories from the command line. And that's what git click enables you to do. You can install it from npm. Now you have access to the git click command from your command line. Now we'll set up git click once by running git click config. Now add your first box. We'll give it a name of test GitHub. We'll be using GitHub as our provider. For GitHub, the username is just the email address you signed up with. I'll enter my password. Now, please note that GitClick currently saves your credentials unencrypted on your hard drive. If this is a security concern for you, I am hoping to add encryption and OAuth authentication in the future. Next, we'll set up some defaults for our box. These can always be overridden, but in most cases you won't need to do that. We would like to have issue tracking, a wiki, and our repositories should not be private. Okay, we have our first box added. A real life application of this would be maybe having a box for your personal open source GitHub work, and maybe another one for your private repositories on Bitbucket. To create a repository for a certain box, you can simply type git click remote and then the name of your box. In our case, that was test GitHub. Now git click will use the GitHub API to set up a remote repository with the current directory name as the repository name. You could also specify a custom repository name if you wanted. If we click the clone URL, we can verify that the remote repository has been created. We can now just copy the SSH URL, add it as remote, and push our code to the remote repository. Thanks for watching this basic introduction to GitClick. You can check out the repository on GitHub, I'll just link it in the YouTube description for this video. If you find any bugs or other problems, please use the issue tracker on GitHub. You can also use that for future requests. Thanks again. I hope to see you soon. See ya.